Hello my pinkies and welcome to another plan with me video. This week I'm going to use Naomi Love Design Tranquility Kit here. It's Erin Conjuring Kit. I've decided as you know from my last video that I am no longer going to hoard kits and the only way to hoard them is to put them in my planner so I have everything all in one planner and this Erin Condren is going to be my trophy Erin Condren planner. I'm going to spread out the kits, kids, <laughs> spread out the kits so you can see what's included with this kit here. So you have a page of full boxes, you have your washi page, your checkbox, your functionals, and your headers. I've also pulled out washi to match this kit already. And the washi I am using here is one of them is from my In the Summer. The vintage bow one is the blue one, and then the two hearts is my ballet empty kit. Kit. Washi collection. Here's a look of last week's spread, and this kit was by Oso Papery. And if you have not watched it yet, I'll put the link in down below. This week plan with me, we're going to plan from July 9th to July 15th. Let's get started. Because this kit does have a bottom washi, I'm going to start with that because that's definitely a no-brainer. <laughs> the kit also comes with headers, so obviously that's another no-brainer. I'm going to add that on top. And lately, I've been really enjoying my scattered planning, so I'm, this week I'm going to do scattered planning too. So for that, I have to lay down all my full boxes. And when I do do my full boxes, I like to do just from Monday to Friday because usually my weekends are very unplanned and I have no idea what I'm going to do on the weekends. Usually after I place down my full boxes, I would give it a washi border. So here I am just picking out the gray. However, the more I'm staring at this spread at the bottom washi, I felt it was kind of bare. So I decided to use my 15mm Endless Summer washi here to put down the quotes and it works very well with the design. I am going to do the same on the other side too. However, I didn't really think this through because I didn't measure the position, so right here I'm just eyeballing it. And now back on to our spread up above. I'm just going to put borders around the full boxes. The format of each day or each column in the book goes by full boxes, then my meal plans, and then my to-do list, and then my daily events. And I will repeat that on every column until Friday. Once I have my weekdays all sorted out, it's time to figure out the weekend. And for the weekend, I know for sure that, that the bottom corner, the Sunday block one, I always leave that one for my next week because that's my go-to page. Where every time I do my next week spread, I will flip to that to make sure that I have everything that needs to be done next week on that page from this page. I hope I didn't confuse you there. So at this moment, I decided that I would do a weekend banner at the top. So the mid section of the weekend, I'm just going to fill it up with the other two full boxes that I had. And in her kit, it was a double full boxes, so it's 
best place to put your double boxes is over the weekend and it's a bed so it tells me to relax and sleep in and with the empty box at the bottom of Saturday I'm just gonna leave that as my today's for whatever event is happening on that day I apologize that the planner is kind of out of frame I am working on the weekend banner that's why it's kind of closer to me towards the bottom of the frame honestly I don't know what I'm doing when it comes to weekend banners because I don't know if there's a rule or if there's a way to do it. What I do is usually I will position my two biggest one at the outside and then whatever's inside the smaller washies or even um, stickers from the kit. Sometimes the kit comes with washi stickers. So I just cut that into flags and just place it on top. And then finally once my banner's done, I put the weekend banner on top or the weekend sticker on top. And once that done, the final step is to fill in my todays with quarter boxes or half boxes, whatever stickers I have left from the kit. And now we are going to fill in our sidebars. With my sidebar, I usually use it for my Instagram um, to mark off ideas or what I need to post for that week. And I also use my sidebar as goals that I like to gain for this week. And before I ink this or before the pen, I like to go through day by day and place in any functional sticker that needed for that day. almost forgot to put the numbers down for the date. The numbers that I'm using is actually from my mystery kits and just have to add a few more items for the weekend. And here it is guys. This is before the pen. I usually love looking at spreads before the pen because it just looks so pretty like a big photograph and you just look at it. So I'm going to fill this planner out off camera and then once I'm done I'll bring it back here as you can see. And that's it. Well I hope you guys enjoyed this plan with me video. I know it's super short compared to the other one that I had which was like a haul and a plan with me but I do like to keep my plan with me video short and sweet. As you all know, as of Sunday slash Monday, Etsy is going to increase their fees and their prices and that we are slowly moving over to our website. So anytime that I say my shop, I am now referring to our website. If I do say that there's something in the Etsy shop, it will be referred to as Etsy shop. Sorry for the confusion, but I think this is the only way for me to clarify when I say you can find these items in my shop, which is now going to be my website, which is thepinkroomco.com and if you guys have not checked it out just swing on by if you have time we did install or introduce a few new features there's the currency converter and also the pinky bow points reward that you can earn and collect points for rewards a quick reminder we are a Canadian shop so when you do check out it will be in Canadian however if you want to look at the prices in your currency you could convert the currency but when it's time for checkout, it's all in Canadian. And that's it, my pinkies. I hope you enjoyed this plan with me video, and I will see you next week. Happy planning. Bye. Mm -hmm.